there. My name is Tyron Walter M. Hermoso, and I am excited to dive into a math adventure with you today. We will be tackling a math problem using a super cool tool called Bar Models. Let's get started. Let me read the story problem. Once upon a time, there lived two sisters, Chen and Noemi, in a village. One day, they created some paper flowers. Chen created 487 paper flowers. She created 191 more paper flowers than Noemi. How many paper flowers did the two girls create all together? So, here's the problem we're going to solve together. First, we have to understand the problem. Chen created 487 paper flowers. Jen created 487 paper flowers. She also created 191 more paper flowers than my meat. The question is, how many paper flowers did the two girls create all together? and Noemi. We have to find the total number of paper flowers that Noemi created before we find the total number of paper flowers of the two girls. Now, I'm going to draw a bar model to show the number of paper flowers. One bar for Jen. One bar for Jen. And another bar for Lainey. This small space is for extra. These bars, I put a question mark here because we still don't know how much paper flowers that may be created. These bars will help us visualize our information we have. Now, since Jen created 487 paper flowers, I will label her bar with 487. And this small space right here represents the 191 that Jen created more than Noemi. So I will write 191. Uh, to get how many paper flowers that may be created is to simply subtract 487 400 87 and 191 Remember, in addition or subtraction, 
always start from once. This is once, then tens, lastly hundreds. Seven minus one is six. Eight, eight minus nine cannot be because eight is smaller than nine. We have to borrow one from four and four will become three and eight will become eighteen. Eighteen minus nine is nine. Three minus one is two. So the answer is 296. So Noemi created 296 paper flowers. Now, let's find the total number of paper flowers. I will erase the question mark and write 296. Now, let's find the total number of paper flowers made by Jen and Naomi by simply adding their number in each bars together. This is Jen's bar. This, this is Jen's bar. She created 487 paper flowers. And this is Naomi's bar. And this is Naomi's bar. She created 296 paper flowers. Let's solve the problem. 487 plus 296. Again, in addition or subtraction, always start from once. This is once, then tens, lastly, Hundreds. Seven plus six is thirteen. Write three below six and one carry one on top of eight. One plus eight is nine. Nine plus nine is eighteen. Write eight below nine and carry one. On top of 4. 1 plus 4 is 5. 5 plus 2 is 7. So the answer is 783. So Jet and Limey created 783 paper flowers all together. Now, I will erase the question mark and write 783. Now, Our answer is correct by subtracting 783 and 296. 3 minus 6 cannot be because 3 is smaller than 6. We have to borrow 1 from 8 and 
three will become seven and three will become thirteen. Thirteen minus six is is put thirteen in mind and show six fingers. Thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven. So the answer is seven. Seven minus nine cannot be because seven is smaller than nine. We have to borrow one from seven and seven will become six. And seven will become seventeen. Seventeen minus nine is we have to borrow uh, put the put seventeen in mind and show nine fingers. 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. So the answer is 8. 6 minus 2 is 6, 5, 4. So the answer is 487. So our answer is correct. Yes! We did it! Thank you for joining me today as we solve this word problem using bar models. I hope you had as much fun as I did. Remember, learning math can be exciting adventure. Thank you! Bye!